And then sometimes when we're on a team, you know, we feel a little bit uncomfortable because of the pressure when we're on a team of other people and don't want to really have conflict with our team members because, you know, we spend more time with the people we work with than the people we live with. And we claim we love them. So what comes into play in team dynamics is conformity. Solomon Ash used to draw three lines on the board, A, B, or C, and then a line X, and he'd ask his students which line, you know, is about the same length as X, and, but he first paid 10 students to all say C. So they go C, 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 get the 11th student, and they go C? Because of the pressure, 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 pressure to conform. And then at the end of the class, everybody else just turned in your reaction papers, is it A, B, or C? They all come in B. It wasn't an optical illusion, it was pressure. Pressure to conform. So what happens sometimes in team dynamics is you're the only person that disagrees and you kind of give up and say, well, if I was, you know, you know, I'll just go along with it. And it leads to this thing called groupthink. I call it groupstink. 